ثانيه توبه من الله هي تو فاست فور تو مانس كونتينوسلي ذات از اكسبيشن اند ذات از توبه ذات از ايكت اوف سيكينج فورغيفنس فروم الله ذا المايتي So, fasting is actually in uh, expiation, ransom, and seeking forgiveness from Allah the Almighty. This is between Allah the, and the man. Whatever the court decides, it's a, d- a, d- a different story. It's between Allah and the man. Then, as I told you, previously fasting is not only a medical treatment not only it's a military training course it actually gives us a balanced kind of personality in the sense that uh, we free ourselves from our daily mundane life all the time eating all the time drinking all the time running after cardinal desires animal desires this actually frees us from the bonds of animalism and after 30 days compulsory training it brings about a balanced condition of personality it frees us from the clutches of animalism and then enhances spiritualism by Antikaf reciting the Quran at night by praying to Allah most of the time by crying unto Him after midnight so a balanced kind of personality is produced after 30 days and and the benefits of uh, personality uh, benefits of fasting is that uh, fasting actually inculcates in our personalities good habits because when we fast it's not only our stomach it's not only our mouth which fasts no that we are not eating anything or we are not drinking anything or we are not having sexual act no this is incomplete fast whenever we fast we fast with the whole of our personality our mind fasts our heart fasts our thinking capacities fast our feelings and emotions fast our tongue fasts we are supposed to talk nonsense talk ill of that man or this man by fasting our hands our feet our eyes our ears each and every organ of our body has to fast that is the real fasting this is what the prophet uh, peace be upon him said wa basa imin laysa lahu min siyamihi illa al-ju'a wal 'atsh wa rabb baqa imin laysa lahu min qiyamihi illa as-sahr There are many fasting persons who do not gain anything out of their fasts except hunger and thirst. And there are many people who stand at night in front of Allah the Almighty saying prayers and they do not get anything out of their prayers except keeping awake. And also the Prophet peace be upon him told and I will read out the uh, traditions of the Prophet peace be upon him also in detail that whenever that a person observes fast and then keep strong telling lies are talking ill of others are doing wrong things then it's not uh, necessary for him to keep allah the almighty doesn't need that he should remain hungry and thirsty just for nothing means actually he's not fasting so the real fast is that man should fast with the whole of his personality The Prophet peace be upon him said that fasting is a shield till you break through it. 